it sounds like you've been pretty much staying inside, right? You haven't been around other people, anybody you've been around have any symptoms of coronavirus, anything like that? I have been going outside a lot in the yard and, and recently I heard our neighbors coughing and there was quite a gust of wind that day and I don't know if it got in my eyes. She hasn't left the I... house in weeks, so I find it highly unlikely that she's been around anyone who has it. Thank you. The thing is, is that he's left the house. He's gone to the grocery store and he's not quite careful. I'm sorry, you are, are you family member or? It's complicated, I'm her roommate now? Yeah, my roommate. Right. Okay. And she does have a tendency, no offense, to, to worry a little bit. She's kind of obsessing over the news and watching the death count and she just lost her job. She's not really eating well, she's up all night. Really from the symptoms you're describing and from the situation, no known exposures. It seems very unlikely that what you're describing is coronavirus. Okay. It sounds far more likely your symptoms are related to stress. Yeah, I mean, I guess I'm under a little bit of stress. Um, but I will say a lot of that stress is that I have this crazy unfortunate situation where I'm actually quarantining with my ex-boyfriend and he's, um, I, I, it's uh, Nick and he's a terrible communicator and he's really, I, I don't know if there's a medication you could give to Nick that would help me be less stressed or when I'm around me? or just something we could do to oh, make okay, this me, less uh, stressful. Let me just chime in here. 